Okay, this is just getting a little bit too much. There's too many cons. Let's, uh... My desk is just not big enough for this. Honestly. My desk is not big enough. Nothing I have is big enough. This is just... Oh, let's make some room. Got around 140 cards. Lots of duplicates. Lots of good inventory, good stock. Really nice cards that people like. Pretty happy. And right now, I'm going to show them to you. <clears throat> now, with one of my... We'll start off with this pile right here. I think that's a good idea. How you going? How are you? Hope you're doing great. Hope your day is great. Hope you... If you're a seller, I hope your sales are going great. Pretty good start to the year so far, so... I'm happy. I hope you're happy. I've got a new light. Kind of looks like shit, but oh well. Alright, so first card. Gengar. Dark Phantasm. Let's move these to the left. Oh, got my keyboard. It's kind of gross. So I got a PSA 9 on this single strike Houndoom. Kind of sad. These cards are nines. You generally just tend to lose. Um, is that card damage? Nope. Oh, it is. Right there. A little bit of edgeway. See? Don't make that mistake. Don't do the same thing I did. Awesome Wild Blaze Charizard. Absolutely awesome card. Not the secret rare, but still really great. PSA 10 on that. PSA 10 on this one. Wild Blaze Charizard. Another one. Oh, who would have thought? Another Charizard VX Climax. Now we've seen that card before. And we got some more character rares. These are so good. These kill me. These black and white cards are so hard to find in mint condition. So, like, whenever I get a 9, it's like, oh, but you know, you get. Like, honestly, this. These nines right now make take me back to like 2017 when I used to create a lot of like Wizards of the Coast hollows and I would sell them for like a hundred dollars in PSA 10. And then like I would sell the nines for like thirty dollars, and that's how it feels right now. Get a nine on a black and white, and then you get a ten. Even though this is an uncommon from black and white four, these are so hard to grade. And they are even harder to find in mint condition. Like you have to find someone who has opened a box and sleeved them straight away, and even then you can just get unlucky. <clears throat> yeah, we got the Mew, Awakening Psychic King, amazing card, Arcus V, pre-order promo, PSA 9, 9s are stacking up, you know, pretty good, got Galarian, Berserker, Pikachu V, Koro promo, I don't want to show too many cards off that like, I've already shown before, so everything here is in my store, obviously, oh, very, very damaged at the top of this card. I don't know what the hell that is, but... It's very unfortunate, I mean... Oh, this card's destroyed. Did I just not see this when submitting it? I must have just skipped over. So hard to see. You have to put in, like, the, the correct angle. But yeah, if you see that, don't submit that, because that's a PSA 8. And then we got another Houndoom. Actually got a 10 on one of them. Pretty happy on that. I'm going to go up a little bit more. Sorry if my desk or mouse pad's a bit messy or it's disgusting, like... I'm sorry, but I, I have cats that sit on my desk all day. I have, you see, I got so much hair. It's kind of gross. I mean, it's just how it is. I'm here all day. I eat at my desk. I spill food. I eat off the desk with crumbs. I'm sorry. We got a PSA 4 on this. I don't really know. I bought this card and I thought it was in better condition, but it looks like I straight up just got scammed. It's got like a dent there and it's got like a crease there. I'm not sure how. Like, am I just an idiot? But oh well. Some more Hound Dooms. To be honest, I've never sold one of these cards, and I have like 10 PSA 10s, and it's not very good. I don't know why I did that to myself. I've sold all of these ones though. Very, very pretty card. Very pretty Nymphia VMAX. Just amazing. It's um a little bit textured. Not as much as like an Alt Art VMAX, but it's not too bad. Very nice the way they did this. Dark Flash Bar Flareon. That 9. It's a little bit crushing, but you know, it is what it is. I'd love to get those in tens. I honestly feel like collecting some of those black and white cards in tens because they are very low pop and they're very hard to get. Especially these Dark Rush cards, man. All the evolutions. But you can see here, this little corner is a little bit lipped up. That might be what it is. Right, whoever graded this really, really didn't want me to get that ten. It's so clean. It is so clean. Amazing. It's good stuff. Okay, what else have we got here? We've got a Palkia Legendary Shine collection. Is that me? Hello, is that me in the thing? 
It's my reflection. How can I do this in a way that like won't reflect, but won't ruin the quality of the video? That's a little bit better. Oh wow, look at that. Charmander Stormfront 9. I'd love 10s on these. I sell them quite frequently. I buy a lot, but unfortunately I just don't get 10s. Got some Mewtwo V stars. You know, pretty easy seller, $50 each, stocking fillers. Mewtwo V, I love Mewtwo. He's a really cool card. Got some friends that like Mewtwo. They're really cool people, so. A lot of this is bulk. I like to get like five of the same card. I hate just making one listing for like one card. Got some Reshi Rams, Detective Charizards. That's really good. Detective Charizard GX is probably like a $40, $50 seller. It's not too bad. I make like $10 on those. And they're just good because it's from the movie. It's pretty unique. It's not really like a original artwork because it's just like a picture from the movie, but not too bad. I'm really happy I got these Pikachu with the birthday hat on. With the birth ball. It's the Pokemon Go gift, but it looks like a birthday hat. Pretty happy I got that. We got the Beamax Climax Jolteon. As you can tell, I most of my submissions are mostly modern, and as the year goes on, that's going to change. I'm going to be grading a lot of cards from like 06 to 2013, as I think the modern market it is kind of it's pretty easy to do it. I would not do it if you like want to get your money back fast because you're competing with so many people. But I feel like I have to do it as like I'm running a graded card store. A lot of people like modern; they want the most recent things. On the end of time. This is so hard. This is like two thousand dollars PSA ten, and this one is so clean. Wow, that's clean. God damn, is that only a only a seven? Because of this one corner, they all have this. I'm not really too happy with this grade, to be honest. Oh, I'll go back to this Pikachu. Centering's not the best. I'm gonna resubmit this. Maybe. Oh, that bottom one on the left. My friend got a PSA 10 in this card with the same issues. I think I can. I think I can go once more with that card. All those cards have those issues. I feel like it can kind of get overlooked a little bit. And you can probably squeeze that 10. Oh, this is beautiful. Awesome charm. And then we've got another Mew. we got one more Mew. And, oh. Another Mew, okay, Ooh, another Mew, and one more, pretty good seller, Awakening Psychic King, great set, EV character is, can't go wrong, might make like $10 per card, every time I sell one I just buy a few more, submit a few more, just how it is, Meowth Legendary Shine Collection, pretty nice card, more Mewtwo V-Stars, or Chespin, that's so cute, Tsuko on the Shida, that's pretty nice. Creator of Pikachu, one of the goats. Look at that centering, left to right. Don't do that. Don't make my mistake. Just sell them raw. Oh wow, that's a pretty rare. That's a pretty rare hyper rare, to be honest. Oh, we got an eight on this one. What have we got here? Hmm. Can't really tell. I don't know what this is. A piece of plastic on my card? Just there, I don't know what that is. But someone's nail or something? I don't know. This card has a print line here, but I don't know. I don't know why this is an eight, to be honest. Oh well. Figure it out. Got ten on that. Oh, I've already shown those. Oh, Pikachu. Oh. Bit of a theme with this, I guess a lot of full arts, a lot of old cards. Oh, what an amazing artwork. Arita, of course. Another Arita. Arita, 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 Arita. He's a goat. For sure. What do we got? Ooh, ooh. Nice. Dark Rush Boulder Sword. Very happy to have that. And Dark Rush Pikachu. They will not be sold for cheap. I'm sorry. Getting PSA 10s on those is like... It's nearly impossible, so I'm, if you want those, they're going to be listed for a lot. Probably $300, $400. Awesome Mewtwo. Oh, Uniqlo Pikachu 4. I am kind of silly, I guess. 
Oh, there's a little bend in the left there. You can see the light, the way it moves right there. Yep. I mean, that's just how it is. That's my bad. Dark Rush, we pour out. Oh, I love Dark Rush. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Would have liked to get more tens from Black and White, but that's fine. Character rares, Pikachu. I mean, I love these things. Honestly, I could sell this card at cost and just flood the market because I love it so much. I think everyone should have one of those. I usually treat my Pikachu collectors a little bit better than other collectors just because Pikachu's the best. And if they like Pikachu, I like them. Oh, Adventurer's Discovery, PSA 10, that's pretty nice. Some Genesec V, all cards. Some Galarian Berserkers, maybe I shouldn't have graded so many of those. Another Houndoom 9. Wild Blaze 8. Oh, Starter Pack EX. They look very similar. Look at those hollows, it's crazy. Oh, nice. Unfortunately, I got a 9 on that, but it's fine. Sell that $200 or so. That'll be fine. We'll find more. Rotom V. I know I'm kind of rushing through these, but I've got about a minute left on the phone before we uh, run out of space, so. They are all the same card. More Mewtwo V stars. Corviknight, Remax. Look at that cool texture. That's so crazy. They got a guy like sitting on the Pokemon. Jolteon. Origin Form Dialga. Just more inventory for the store, just stuff I sell regularly, so always good to have quantity. And they got the Bolt on V. Well, that's it. Not a bad submission. It's like 140 cards, but a lot of the same, so it doesn't really like. Doesn't really like, you know, fit. It doesn't feel like 140 cards. But we've got that Charmander Stormfront 10. Got that Hell Blizzard Pikachu. That's really good, so. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.